So, Renee, remember when I used to tell you stories about how in uh, London and in Paris, they weren't going to allow combustion engines into the cities, and that was supposed to take place in 2030. Yep. And you were all like, no way, that's impossible. Who would ever do that? Well, I guess it is possible because now um, the European standard for emissions, which now we're up at what, EU6, I guess right. it is? Right, so European, not have, they haven't always been stricter, but they have been stricter. Increasingly, increasingly stricter. stricter. Uh, than we have here in the United States, and now Japan has is following, just, suit. Is following suit, and they've just come up with uh, very strict uh, emission standards for uh, Japan, uh, affecting motorcycles in particular. Right. So Honda, being the biggest manufacturer of motorcycles in the world, is, they are going to be cutting 10, 10, 10 motorcycles from their production line. Right. Specifically, we've heard. We've heard the Goldwing. Now. As of uh, 2022, the Honda Goldwing baggers, you couldn't even get a manual. But with yeah. this new ruling coming out, we're concerned that you won't be able to get a manual or perhaps even a DCT in the near future. Yeah, so it's really not looking good for the six speeds uh, because of, you know, with a DCT, you could program the, the computer, you know, controls the shifting, you could program its shift points and you could eliminate, el eliminate some of the emissions uh, that away. Well, essentially what that means is the computer controls how many hydrocarbons are coming out of that pipe at any given time. Right, so with a manual, you could just, you know, shift whenever you feel like it and just blow out carbon out the tailpipe. Not, it's not really efficient, but with the DCT, um, it will obviously shift at the most optimum points, you know, so we're not quite sure of the timeline and there are a lot of conflicting reports out right now there's a lot of rumors there's a lot of conflicting reports in the media right so that being said uh if you want to get yourself a gold wing with a six speed manual you should probably start looking uh i don't know yesterday <laughs> because uh those would probably be the first on the cutting blocks and uh, I'm sure the DCT will be right around uh, the, the corner. corner. And yeah. this raises the question, what's next? Will there be an E-Wing? Right, so, you know, eventually that opens the door for an E-Wing and that would be maybe an awesome thing. You know, we'll have to wait and see. Yeah, but essentially performance sport bikes and the large touring class leisure uh, bikes are, are in a bit of trouble according to this news, so. You know what, what we're going to do is we're going to follow this story along and we are going to put some information in the comments and uh, see what we can find out as the story develops. Yeah, we'll definitely keep everybody posted. Uh, let us know your thoughts, how you feel about uh, the end of uh, an era. Yeah, the end of a Goldwing era. Yeah. Potentially. Potentially. Probably. Most probably. Yeah. Anyway, thanks a lot, guys. We'll talk to you next time. All right.